Hi tech enthusiasts, welcome back to our channel Fast Cabling. So today in this video, we are diving into a common scenario that many of us may encounter. The challenge of extending power over Ethernet in a long-range setup. Now traditionally, people tend to resort to multiple PoE extender to bridge that gap. But we know the limitation of PoE is 100 meters, that's 328 feet. So for example, if I want to install an IP camera that is situated 500 meters away, that means I will need to add a PoE extender in every 100 meters. And there will be 4 extenders in total. But let's face it, that can lead to a host of issues. Now in a daisy chain of PoE extender, each extender can extend in the reach, but also add in complexity to the network voltage drop issues, signal degradation, and a tangled mess of cables. It's like a tech jungle out there. So the more PoE extender evolved, the higher the complexity in identifying and troubleshooting issues. And pinpointing the source of problem becomes a time-consuming task. And you may have to dig up all your PoE extender and find out which one is broken. So the question is, how can we extend the reach without daisy chaining PoE extender? Now imagine that's a single device that simplifies everything. No more daisy chain, no more complexity, just an efficient solution that extends power and data over a long distance seamlessly. Now with this compact long-range PoE switch, now you can get extended power reach, centralized power management, and simplify infrastructure. It's like upgrading from a bumpy dirt road to a smooth highway for your data and power transmission. And the best part is, it is not just solving problem, it is about unlocking possibilities. So let's check out the details. So now let's check out the details. This switch has four 100 megabit per second RJ45 PoE port and two 100 megabit per second RJ45 Ethernet uplink port. But keep in mind, only port 1 and port 2 can support long distance PoE transmission. It is also compatible with the IEEE 802.3 AF and AT standard, that's PoE and PoE Plus, and support up to 30 watts maximum output power. And the power source is already built in to the long-range PoE switch, so no additional AC outlet is required near the connected PD. And next, let's put this to work. So now we are in front of the demonstration board and I'm going to show you how to connect cameras that is 500 meters away using our compact long-range PoE switch. So let's do it from the beginning. Here I have a router to provide internet access and a network video recorder to display video footage. I'm going to connect them to our long-range PoE switch. Plug them into the Ethernet uplink port and then, remember that I said only port number 1 and 2 are the long-range port. So let's plug the Ethernet cable to port number 1. Here I don't have a 500 meters Ethernet cable, so I'm going to use a 200 meters and 300 meters and join them together using this coupler. So here I achieve 500 meters in total. But then, we'll need a PoE adapter. Now the long-range PoE switch has a long-range chipset built in, but the camera doesn't. That's why it won't send back the signal. And we'll need this PoE adapter to help us send back the signal to the long-range PoE switch. And each long-range PoE switch comes with one PoE adapter. And this is an IP67 waterproof rated adapter, so you can put it outdoor. I took out the neck and the gland for easy installation. Here we have the input port. Let's plug it in. And then using a short patch cord to connect to this bullet camera and to our adapter. This adapter has a special mounting tool so you can mount it on a DIN reel. 
just like this. And I can hear the sound of the bullet camera working, that means it is getting both power and data. And I'm going to check out the video. Here you can see a live video. So it can work with a bullet camera, but what about a high power PDZ camera? Let's try it. So first I'm going to unplug the sharp edge cord from the bullet camera. And then let's try it out on the PDZ camera. Voila, so now it's getting both power and data at the same time. And you may wonder, why can't it support a high power PDZ camera? Because our long range PoE technology is actually utilizing all four twisted pairs of the wire in an Ethernet cable. That's why it can support a PDZ camera. So now let's check out the video on our monitor. Let's make sure we add the camera to the list. And here we go. I'm going to wave my hand to show you this is absolutely a live video. So the whole connection is done now. So the adoption of a long-range PoE switch offers plenty of advantages that significantly enhance the efficiency of network infrastructure beyond the seamless extension of power and data over extended distances. The centralized power management inherent in the long-range PoE switch simplifies the maintenance task and reducing the need for frequent intervention and minimizing downtime. Moreover, the versatility of the long-range PoE switch opens up diverse application scenario suitable for various environments and providing a robust solution for those seeking efficient power and data transmission over extended distances. And also, you can explore a world of cutting-edge solution and innovative products on our website. Whether you're seeking the latest gadget powerful networking solution, or transformative tech insight, we've got you covered. So visit our website now for a tech journey that goes beyond the ordinary. Thank you very much for joining us, and I'll see you in the next video.